This test method is for testing painted wood and metal surfaces for the presence of lead. This method is described in detail in the instructions that are in your kit. For this test, you will need one or more 3M lead check swabs. 3M lead check swabs can detect lead at the level of 600 parts per million. Note, you will need a separate 3M lead check swab for each area to be directly tested. You will also need a sharp utility knife. You should also have some alcohol wipes on hand to clean the blade of the knife before and after testing each area. This is done to prevent cross-contamination. It is important that each test be conducted in exactly the same manner. Do not squeeze the 3M lead check swab until the area to be tested has been prepared. Once the chemicals inside have been mixed and activated, they remain effective for approximately 90 seconds. Before testing the painted surface, use the clean utility knife to cut through the paint layers to the bare substrate. Now you may prepare to activate the 3M lead check swab. Note that there are two separate glass ampules inside each 3M lead check swab, and that both must be crushed to activate the reagent liquid. Do not crush these ampules unless the cardboard cover is in place, completely covering both of the glass ampules. Now, activate the 3M lead check swab by firmly squeezing each end at the points marked A and B on the cardboard cover until you can feel and hear the ampules inside being crushed. Shake the tube vigorously for a few moments to be sure that the chemicals inside have mixed. The 3M lead check swab is now activated and ready for use. Squeeze the tube until you see a bit of the reagent liquid soaking down through the fibers of the swab and appearing at the end of the swab tip. Firmly rub the wet tip of the swab across the surface at the point where you cut through the paint layers. Continue to gently squeeze the sides of the tube. Apply only enough pressure to keep the tip wet with the reagent liquid. If lead is present in any of the paint layers, you may see a pink to red reaction on contact. Red means lead. If not, rub the area until color develops, but not longer than 30 seconds. If the swab and surface remain unchanged after 30 seconds, lead has not been detected. If the test is negative, confirm the reactivity of the 3M lead check reagent by squeezing a drop of the reagent liquid onto one of the test confirmation cards. The circle should instantly turn red. Don't forget, red means lead. Testing some industrial paints requires longer development time. Read the instructions regarding chromate paint in your instruction sheet for more information. Pigments containing lead chromate are rarely found in household paints. 3M lead check swabs do not expire, so when filling out the EPA form, use the lot number shown on the swab in the expiration date field. The lot number can be found on the cardboard cover or on the plastic tube underneath the cardboard cover.